Hello, welcome to my channel. I'm Gina. I'm working in my Christmas journal again today. And today I'm going to take a prompt from this um, December Daily Collage 2020. I'm using this this year. Um, I'm doing a lot of them this year, but I really like this one because it was collaging. I love to collage. This is from 49 Dragonflies and it's December Daily 2020. I'm going to do number 18, add a tag. So I'm going to circle this one and get my date stamp. That's not the one I like to use. Oh, here's the one I like to use. Today is December 7th. I'm going to put it on something a little bit stronger than that here. <laughs> and date it. I just do this so that um, I keep all who keep this with the journal, and then someday I can look back and see, okay, why did I do that? <laughs> I can see December seventh and find December seventh in there and see, oh, okay, that's why that page is that way. So I'm gonna put this back in here, and I did already collage on the page. It's kind of gonna, um, it's not really going to go with what I'm doing, but what I'm doing is going to cover it up a lot. So I'll show you um, the tag. I made my tag this big. So the tag is going to really take um, center stage. <laughs> it's taking most of it, so I think it will be fine. Um, that what I'm doing is going to kind of clash, but not really. It's all Christmas colors, you know. So. I think it will be okay. So, I found this image in, let me grab the book here. It's in this book, Memories of the Present. And it's just a sweet little book. It's got all these pretty pictures in it. I love the coloring in it. It's got so many, I'll just kind of flip through it here. So many pretty pictures. I love that one. So when I saw it, I thought, "Ooh, I gotta get, I gotta buy that one." So I love bubble lamps. I love this. I'm hoping to use this somewhere along the way. It talks about all the different trees. And this one's sweet. I almost used that one when we had to have a musical instrument. Oops. So anyway, I love this. Love, love, love that one. I think, um, yeah, the other side's really super sweet too. So, anyway, so we're going to use that today. And then I have a bunch of stuff here that I want to use to collage. I don't, have, I know I'm not going to use all of it, but I just took it. But I have a tin full of collage stuff. It's um, digitals that I printed and this is out of a, it's a leftover, here we come a caroling, I thought that was perfect. Just a bunch of stuff that I pulled out that I can collage around them. So first thing I guess I got to do is cut this out. So, excuse me a moment. So I will get them cut out. I really wanted to use this family somewhere along the way. So I thought today was as good as any. I'm having trouble cutting. My hands are not still not doing well today. <laughs> may have to call and get in. I don't want to. That's like a whole afternoon or morning away. Because it's, it's a good hour away from here. <sighs> joys of rural living. <laughs> I know so we had a major 
weather change and I know that's what it is and we're about to have a major weather swing the other way so I'm just trying to hold out thinking well it's gonna swing the other way maybe that will change things our weather is so weird it's gonna get warm again like is it December or what is it <laughs> it's like we're trying to go back to spring or something I don't know it's weird Sorry, I just don't really have anything to talk about today. I've been staying home. My daughter was going to come over and work on the house today, but um, she decided not to. And so I stayed home. I was glad to stay home. <laughs> I'm always glad to stay home. I am a homebody. person that doesn't know what it means to be bored at home. If I didn't craft, I would still wouldn't be bored because, oh, I made that plenty big. <laughs> because, you know, there's, there's sewing. Well, I guess that's crafting, but there's cooking. There's always laundry. <laughs> TV does get boring, but there's still plenty to watch. I stay busy just trying to watch all the YouTubers I like to watch. Especially right now. Goodness, I can't keep up with everybody. <laughs> So many I want to watch. <laughs> All right. Well, there's a lot of room to get some collaging on here, huh? All right. Well, I've got some of these that are pretty big. If I hide that kind of under there, let's do that. Oh, I didn't get my, I'm going to put my book up here. These are some of the things I got. I got my fabric and this fabric and this. That's some of my options for making my tie at the top, but I'm going to set those up there. Get my glue book out. Put it over. Mitzi, really? Can you lay down and wait a little while? Lay down and wait just a little while, okay? I just checked with you right before I did this, and you were not wanting out of your bed. Wait a little while, okay, Mitzi? Lay down. Silly dog. I get another new glue stick. Okay, let's see. I really did. I checked right before. She was like, I'm not getting out of bed. I'm just fine right here, Mom. <laughs> I had the little space heater on then. So she wasn't wanting to leave the space heater. <laughs> now it's off and she's thinking, hmm. This, yeah, this is printable from the 
think. I don't know. I'm not even going to try to tell you all these printables because I've got a lot of printables. <laughs> I can't get this on there straight. Why is it so hard for me to do? It's still not. And the glue is dry. <laughs> this should be easy, right? Unless I didn't cut it straight. That's the problem. I didn't cut it straight. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you have to cut it straight for it to go on there straight, Gina. Well, I'm going to get that straight and I'll cut this side off. <laughs> now I figured out what my problem is. <laughs> did not cut it straight when I cut it out. And just right at this moment, I can't remember. I cannot remember what Christmas printable I got. I can't remember. Oh, that's awful. I cannot remember. butterfly. Oh dear. Oh, I wish I could remember. Yeah, I wonder, can I put that one right there and hide that thumb hole? I can. Okay, let's do that. And it's not on any of this because I've already cut it all out. I will have it listed below. Because a lot of this digital stuff that I'm using is from that. My Christmas digital that I bought. And I love it. But I will have it listed in the info box. Right there. Yes, there. that will work. Okay, what else do I have in here? I'm just going to spread this stuff out. All kinds of stuff. And I know I'm overlapping some things. That's fine. I like this over here because it kind of really coordinates with her jacket, but I don't want to put it right next to it. Why? I don't know. I can't tell you the why. I just don't want it right next to it. putting it sideways because I would like the envelope part of it to show. I probably could have ripped it a little bit and that would have looked nice too. I may rip it trying to get it on here straight. 
<laughs> yeah, I may still rub it. Oh my heavens. I'm not doing so great today. I don't know what's up with me, but I'm not doing the best today. Kind of just not the best. I really like these birds, but I just don't know if they're going to fit anywhere. I think they draw too much attention to themselves. I like this one. Let's see. Let's see what I can do with this. I'm not going to want any of those things I've picked for up there. I kind of think I'm going to want some lace. And I think I'm going to have to use my punch and make that a little bit wider. Punch it a couple more times. Here we come a caroling. Yes, right there is where that needs to go. Maybe I ought to do that punching right now before I put something there. me a bigger spot. Okay. So now we've got them like this. I wouldn't mind having a little bit of this somewhere, but then that means I'm going silver. I don't know that I want to go silver, so maybe we're going to ditch that idea. Uh, what else do I have over here? This is really pretty. That could go right there, but I want something underneath right there. Um, this is kind of pretty. Oh, cold. <laughs> Sorry, I just got a shiver. Ooh. <laughs> Don't know that I want that though. Maybe some of this writing here. I couldn't get a hold of for some reason. Ooh, I'm becoming very indecisive. I wish I would have put something under there first. Can that come up? I should have done that first. No, I don't know if it can. Oh, I messed that up. Okay. Because whatever I put there needs to come up needs to go under it. So I need to put something there first. Um, <laughs> what is that going to be? It could just be a piece of paper here. Oh, I didn't mean to rip that like that. But nope, not that. How about this? sloppy. <sighs> it seriously is getting really cold in here. <laughs> I'm on the outside here and I don't think there's good insulation on this side at all. <laughs> it's really bad. <laughs> Where's my... There it is. This room has always been really cold. Mm. 
Oh, I'm covering that punch up. I'm going to have to re-punch it. That's okay. Okay, what do I want to put on the other side? Here is a bit of a postcard. That would look pretty cool there. I don't know why I didn't think of this before. I put that on there. But I wanted that pretty torn edge to be on top. Plus, if I cover up caroling, it kind of defeats the purpose of having that there, doesn't it? Okay. So. I want that to go underneath there. I didn't cover up. Okay, there we go. There we go. hands are getting sticky sticky. Where's my card? Let me get this. Okay, I think I accomplished this except for now. I need to take my punch. Punch right there. Ooh, I didn't like that at all. <laughs> it did it. It didn't like it, but it did it. Right there. Okay, now I'm going to use my liquid glue. my thing again. Let me just grab another one up there. Alright. I don't know what I did with my lid. There it is. Okay. I'll take my red scissors off. Oh, this is not down. I can feel it. It's not going down. This is what I love about printables. I just, I don't know why it took me so long to catch on. Because it doesn't matter that I just tore those all up. I can just reprint them. Yay! <laughs> all right, so now we got that much done. somewhere here. Is that the one? Caroline. I'd like to put Caroline down. Maybe Caroline could go right there. I'm going to tear the bottom of it so it doesn't look so perfect. I don't know what it is with me and torn edges, but I like them. <laughs> okay. There it is. still need something right there. How's that color look? Yeah? Okay, let's tear. Yep. 
I like that like that. We'll just put that there. get any pinks on here. I should have found some pinks. Oh, I do have some pinks over here. I'll have to get those in here somewhere. I'll have to layer on top of something here and get some pinks. Aha! I moved my whole thing there. I didn't mean to do that. Sorry about that. <laughs> that was bad. <laughs> Sorry. Oops. <laughs> I did pull out some pinks when I was Pulling things out, I just haven't managed to get them on here. Well, I have to do that because we need some pinks. And then I am I'm gonna get some lace. I think this I think it needs some lace for the um, for the tie at the top. Yeah, let me Let's see, I've got a tag, I've got a, another tag. These are from my Christmas printable that I will put down. I thought I had like a ticket shape that was a, yeah, there's a ticket shape. Another ticket shape. Here, here's one that's got a number on it. I like the numbers. Here's one with, I like that one. Here's one. No, that just says no row. Okay. Let's do. I want this one for sure. It says 41. We'll just go with 41. It's got Santa Claus on it. You can barely see him, but he's there. He's there. Stick him like right there. I like that. Now. I got tired when I was cutting these all out. I thought I just got them cut to that point, and then I thought when I'm getting ready to use them, I can do the rest. I was just tired. <laughs> uh -oh. Okay, now do I have room for this one anywhere on here? I like using the number. There, that looks nice right there. Setia flower that is made out of a napkin, I think, or toilet paper. I thought if I could get it to, I may not be able to get it to even, I, I don't know that I can get it straightened out enough. I thought if I could get it to straighten out, I would put it on here, but I don't know if I can. I thought it would be pretty, but oh, it just ripped. Okay, darn, <laughs> darn, darn. Oh, look at that! I just sighed. Oh boy, <laughs> that was a big sigh. Okay, I'm going to put all of my fun stuff. Oh, I have this too. 
That would be pretty, but I need to take my brush to it. It's way too white. enough on here now. I think I'm going to put my people on. I'm going to wipe my hands off a little bit though. I've just got so much glue on them that things are starting to stick to my hands. I don't like it when I get to that point. <laughs> a little on my ink. Grab a drink. All right, let's put these people down. I think I've got them glued enough, or I mean inked up enough. They're really so pretty, I like them. Whoa, I got them way too far over. Okay, make sure I don't have any glue on this side here. I scooted them. Find in my lace. I should put that back in my tin, but I have it up there too far to reach it, so we'll just leave it sitting over here at the side. I'll be right back with my lace. I need to. My computer is doing something weird on me. There we go. watched my videos, you know that I said I did something with my lace. <laughs> well, this is my lace. It's a little box. And yes, it's a Christmas box, but I don't care. It's really cute. It's got a little handles on. I found this at Dollar General. It's really cute. It opens up. And this is my lace. <laughs> yes. And I still have my other one where I've got it organized really, really nice. But I know from being in that yesterday that I didn't have anything. Oh, here, maybe this would be cute. Right on top. Let's see if this would work. If I can get it through here. Oh, I got to ink around my tag real quick. Oh, I like that. I really like that. I think that might be it. To put some of this down here. Yeah, I like that down there too. Hmm. Might have to not have to do any digging because I really like that one on top and I like that down there. 
I was thinking of something really, really lacy, but mm, I kind of like that. That, I don't know if I could push that one through. This I really like. It's so dainty and pretty. Ooh, that one's really pretty too. Oh, I think we're going to do that one. Okay, let me shoot my box over to the side a little bit. And walk this one through. Um, I think we're only going to do about that much. Let me get my crochet thread so we can tie some of it around and tie it. I forgot I had my books down there at my feet and I caught my feet in them. I'm not used to them being there. Okay, let's get my... I think it only needs to be about that tall. It doesn't need to be very tall. This, thread, this lace is so pretty. I don't know if it's hand done or not, but it is just beautiful. I love lace. I just, as you can tell. <laughs> but I've never paid very much for any of my lace. In fact, I've really found very, very good deals on my lace. I don't, I don't think I have any lace that's like, you know, old and worth money or anything. I just have what I find at um, thrift stores and um, yard sales and stuff. I love when we pull up to a yard sale and it's an older lady and she's selling what's out of her, you know, her, her sewing basket. Like once we pulled up and a lady had this and she had like 10 cents on it. And I'm like, oh, this is so wonderful. And she says, you want that old stuff? I said, oh, yes, I do. I mean, look at it. Look at this. Isn't it wonderful? She just was just flabbergasted that I wanted this, and I was so excited over it. <laughs> I love it when I pull up and find that kind of stuff, and, and you know, and the ladies like just flabbergasted that I want that. Well, honey, you can have that. I don't know why you want that, but yes, you take that. I'm glad you want it, but why? <laughs> Yes, I want it, and yes, I will put it to good use, at least what I call good use. <laughs> Those are my kind of yard sales. Love it when I pull up and there's a, it's an older lady. Yay. <laughs> they have the good stuff, in my opinion. <laughs> It won't bother me to have this in my room all year round. Won't bother me at all. That kind of stuff doesn't bother me. I have two of those, two different sizes sitting on top of each other. One has my little fabric because I outgrew my. I have a fabric one that's like the fabric bin, but it's all organized and everything. But it's I've outgrown it in here too, so I have one of those with my outgrown fabric in it. I just need a bigger room, but, you know, since that's not going to happen, I'm trying hard to use my stuff. <laughs> okay, I need this. I just put this up and I need it. No, I don't need that one. That's the wrong bottle. I need this one. I went to rip that and now I'm going to cover it up. But that's what we do, right? This stuff has some elastic in it, so I hope it works okay. This is totally new from 
Hobby Lobby this stuff is. I like to buy the ones that look like they, you know, that have a vintage look to them. Um, I hope this is going to work. I might have to get out my double stick tape. I'm recording this on Tuesday the 7th. You're probably not, I'm probably not going to have this loaded until next Monday. I'm working ahead so that we can, we're going to go down to our daughter's for uh, several days. I, I will probably just be getting home when this, no, I won't be getting home. I'll still be there. <laughs> I'll be getting home tomorrow when you see this. Our plans have changed, so from what they were. That's okay. It just means I get to see my little ones longer. And then I get to stop on the way home, hopefully, and see our other ones. Let's put it in the book. I think it looks okay. I do. I was kind of worried of how I had done the collage. This was a case of I didn't pay attention. Well, I mean, I didn't know what I was doing before when I did the collage. I just did the collage because I got to cover the background of this book before I can do anything. I looked high and low for a Christmas book that I could, you know do my collage in and all I could find was little bitty books I couldn't find any big one except for that one I'm cutting up it has all you know this one that I got this picture out of no way was I going to use that book it wouldn't have worked anyway was a fun one. I like this one. Hold that down for a minute. Oh, I gotta put a date on here somewhere, don't I? Oh, I'll think about that for a minute. Okay, December 7th, hmm, maybe right here, there I think is a good place, and I've been doing it in plum, but I don't think plum is going to work very well on here, so I think I'm going to get my black out, and I probably better stamp off on something. There we go. All right. So, this is my add a tag number 18 on 49 Dragonflies December Daily 2020. That back where it belongs. I'll hold this up so that you can see a little better. Thank you for joining me today. Uh, I'll be seeing you soon. Have a blessed day. Bye-bye.